trying like hell to get out of this driveway. It's full of ice. Let's go for a ride. You are watching Cycle Cruises all on one motorcycle channel. Subscribe today. Cycle Cruiser videos brought to you at 6 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Yeah, buddy! Got a new jacket. I got all, I got some new winter gear here. I'm rocking. Check it out. Ha ha! I got a really sick deal on this new Triumph jacket. Yes, I got a Triumph. Just not a motorcycle. <laughs> A Triumph jacket and uh, man like 56% off guys I'll include a link in the description and comment section of this video to where you can get this jacket I finally got a winter coat I've been putting it off for like five years and I finally got one and I'll tell you guys this jacket is absolutely amazing and uh, on top of that I got some new wired electric gloves here heated gloves that are wired uh, very simply connects to your battery you connect the cord to your battery and then it has a quick disconnect that you connect your uh, your gloves to you run the cable through your jacket sleeve and out the bottom of your jacket and I have it uh, the quick disconnect plug right at the front of my uh, motorcycle seat so that I can easily plug in and if you were to fall off your bike it would easily quick disconnect but these gloves are man these gloves are like hot i gotta learn how to can tone down the uh the heat on them but i'm getting heat all around my fingers everything it feels awesome uh, and this jacket is really nice man high quality jacket high viz gotta have high viz out here on the streets guys help keep you safe and i'm really kind of stupid for riding right now it's like in the 30s Hey, I still have ice all in my front driveway. I had a hell of a time getting out, man. But this jacket, I'm actually burning up in this jacket. I don't know, it's like 36 degrees right now. <laughs> and I'm burning up, man. I don't feel any wind through this jacket. Feels nice and toasty like I'm at home. Pretty awesome jacket, man. Uh, and it fits nice and snug. It has CE armor in it. It's got a a back protector, CE armor, it's got shoulders, uh, elbows, shoulders, it's got a back protector, and you can upgrade the back protector, which I'm just going to slide my Icon uh, CE back protector uh, in the back of it. I haven't had a chance to do it, but I will be doing that. And these, man, no more frost, no more frozen fingers anymore. This is actually better, these gloves are actually better than um than heated grips because heated grips they work out pretty good they work all right but it only gets the inside of your hand like the outside of your hand can still get really cold as where these gloves heated all around and i'll tell you these gloves are fairly inexpensive as well um, it's, they're not a, and you don't have to buy the whole kit. It comes with everything you need. You don't have to buy all extra cables and and uh, you know like some of those other kits out there. You got to buy all the shit extra, and then it all adds up to really expensive. In my opinion, you don't really with a jacket like this, man. You don't really need it like a, a heated liner inside at all. I mean, this jacket is is like like I told you, I'm kind of burning up in it. I just have a t-shirt under it. And also I have a, a, a Nick warmer as well from Alpine Stars and it's freaking amazing. It fits nice and tight to the neck, up to the chin. Uh, you could take it up even further up to your nose if you want to. It has holes in it. And uh, man, I have absolutely no wind on my neck or going up. It feels really good. And also, by the way, I got my uh, Suwami MX Tour helmet, which most people wouldn't think that it's a winter helmet. Uh, but actually because it has vents that are, are open all the time so But uh, I'll tell you guys that I'm fine in 30 degree weather here I'm actually really doing really I don't my face is not cold 
my head's not cold it's a nice uh, blow a, a nice breeze of wind in my helmet to keep it nice and ventilated uh, no fogging issues and what's awesome about this Suami MX Tour helmet why I like dual sport helmets is not only do I have a sun protector here like it helps keep sun out of the uh, out of my eyes but also it uh, I'm able to put my uh, HZ1 uh, Sony action camera here that real small tiny one and if you guys didn't see my installation tip on how to do it you can uh, drill a hole through the top and screw it in and use velcro on the back and it's on there rock solid um, and then run the cord out the back and I have it to a uh, power bank so I can I can ride all day long and it uh, don't have to worry about the batteries going out and also uh, you know it's my black box camera so thumbs up I really love this helmet like I don't even wear my other helmets anymore man this helmet is legit guys by the way I'll include a link to all my gear as I always do in the description and comment section of this video also if you check out my uh, go to my website cyclecruiser.com click on my gear that's a full complete detailed listing of all my gear and cameras because I know you guys ask all the time and uh as far as I'm still for my pants I'm still wearing the the AGV Sport Willow perforated leather pants underneath and I have my uh, my camel pants over top because it has the perforation in it and that keeps the cold air from coming through and my legs are warm I have no issues and I'm rocking the other uh, City Fusion air boots still since 2012 I just double up on the socks it has the uh, the perforation in the boots as well but I double up on the socks my feet don't even really get cold so and then the summertime you need the perforation to keep the air keep your feet cool so yeah guys thumbs up man to this gear this now these gloves which by the way is made by Hotwire these heated gloves that's the name brand of them they are a little a tad bulkier than my regular gauntlet gloves but I mean these are brand new too so they're stiff yet but uh, they're much better than them big, huge Mustang winter gloves that I had look like freaking oven mitts, which did a pretty good job, but your fingers would still get cold if it was like in the 30s. But man, these, these are actually burning my fingers up. I can like freaking uh, figure out how to tone down the, uh, the heat on them. <laughs> Shit. Oh man, I could ride all day like this, guys. This is fucking awesome. Awesome. <laughs> Fucking A, man. Woo! All right. Ride my CBR 1000 fucking double R. I've been riding my WR 250R so much lately. I know you guys have been saying, man, what's up? Where's the CBR? Why don't you ride it, dude? It's all we see is on a dirt bike all the fucking time. We want to see you on the CBR, man. That badass fucking CBR 1000 fucking double. Ah, I love this fucking bike, baby. But high vis is where it's at, as you can see, guys. You can see me a mile away, man, with this jacket. <laughs> Help keep you safe out here on the streets, baby. Also, I meant to mention I also have a new microphone and a new microphone setup. I've got a. Uh, I forgot it's a squid microphone I forgot the name of it but I'll include a link in the description and comment section of this video it costs 50 bucks much more expensive than the uh, Sony ECM CS3 stereo mic that I normally rock out with so uh, this is actually my first time riding with it so hopefully it'll sound good also put some put some fake fur over the microphone but if you want to see more of my gear reviews and uh, other video playlists that I have, go to my website, cyclecruiser.com. Click on the menu tab, My Videos. Uh, all my videos are categorized in the various playlists. Hopefully you can find something that will inform you or entertain you. Hey, hit thumbs up if you like this video. Share this video with your friends. And get you out here riding in the wintertime. I don't want to hear none of that pussy talk. Tell them, oh, it's too cold. It's too cold. Get your ass out here. Ride, baby. Because I know you have them withdrawals like I've been having, man. Soon as I see the roads are clear, baby, 35 plus, I'm out here riding.
I don't give a fuck. I'm riding, baby. As I'll catch you guys later. Deuces! Check out my other channel, Psycho Cruiser Motor Vlogs, where I discuss anything and everything, not just motorcycles.